my shining stars it's your girl jessica renee and i'm back with another shining video okay so when i posted my um back to school advice video it was like comments on like what about the college kids you know so i'm back i'm a little bit late but listen better late than never and let me tell you something right this is like perfect timing because now college has been going on for a little minute you getting used to it you probably feeling discouraged feeling um lazy and this is why these tips are here to remind you okay and without further ado let's just jump right into this video okay so um my main first thing that i'm always gonna say and preach by is don't be afraid to ask for help so a lot of college students feel like just because they're in college and they're considered adults now that they have to figure everything out on their own and they can't ask for help and there's nobody there to help them and that is the biggest lie or like misconception about college period so i do encourage you guys to really just not be afraid to ask for help ask for help ask for help ask anybody it could be um a faculty member at that school it could be literally anybody just don't be afraid to ask for help because there is help out there trust me and believe me okay first things first we're not scared to ask for help second thing second take advantage of opportunities and I want to like move right along with this video because I don't want to talk too much and make it longer than usual. But take advantage of opportunities. Certain schools be having like um, programs, um, you know, just special benefits for people depending on like whatever certain things. It's just so much out there to offer that they be giving away and you honestly just got to go get it. Like go get it. Um, when I was in college at Kingsboro um there was literally a program and in the program we i literally had to do nothing like the program knocked on my front door and they were giving us free um textbooks and our classes were linked and it was just like a really good support system and i used that program until i graduated from there like it really helped me so much so go out there look for them opportunities and take advantage next thing is practice as much discipline as you can when it comes to showing up for class because a lot of professors um are lenient um they treat you like the adults you are and if you don't show up that's just you and it does reflect on your end game like you not showing up for class you won't know the curriculum you won't pass the class and then boom next year you have to retake that class if it's a necessity for you and that's just dumb like i said i feel like this video is coming right at the right time because i know sometimes like people just be over it and listen keep pushing through if anything go to class if the work is too hard and you're not understanding just still go to class show up show that professor that you care about yourself because basically that's what going to class shows like do you care about your future or do you not next thing i kind of already touched on this so i'm gonna just say it real quick like i know i said that the opportunity knocked on my door which it did but it might not be like that for you guys um there is so many programs out here go look for them seek out that information ask questions like i said um just find out all that your school has to offer because you never know what you might get into you know like you never know what you might find so definitely definitely seek out a lot of information make sure you research your school because i'm telling you there are so many programs you will be surprised at what they offer at what they give you so definitely look out for that y'all check everything um board posters that be posted up in the school check the school social media like there's stuff out there trust me before you buy your textbooks well you guys probably already bought textbooks but for future references before you buy your textbooks definitely check to see if your school library has it you can make um copies of it i know a lot of colleges give like free printing that you can make photocopies of it you could take pictures of it you could even check it out the library like or or if you don't want to go the library route 
simply just rent them and you could give them back and you paying like half the price or literally less so definitely try that make sure that like i said you're showing up and don't just show up and be that potato in the class that nobody knows what their voice sounds like or they don't really know your name like be involved build a connection with your professors if you can if you're able to do that because let me tell you something people in general doesn't matter the title people in general are more willing to help you or like you know help you give you more options they're more interested if you build if they have a connection with you if your professor sees you show up every day and then at the end of the semester you're like listen what can i do he's gonna be like nothing like but if you was speaking to that professor the entire semester you were asking questions you did your work and you say listen like i'm not satisfied with my grade what can i do he's most likely nine times out of ten gonna give you something that to help you boost your grade and that just is what literally comes out of building a relationship with your professor get to know them and also i feel like when you connect with your professor more you like the class more you're more interested in what's going on even if it's boring and that just helps you retain the information more i just feel like you do better in the class overall when you build a relationship or a connection with your professor. Like I said, yeah, the next one is engage and participate in class, ask questions, um, answer questions, participate in the discussions, don't be shy. Everybody is there for the same exact thing. Just break out of that shell if you're shy make sure you're participating in that class because that's going to help you build that connection with your professor that's going to make your class experience way better this is such an important step like make sure that you guys are continuously checking your degree works making sure that you're taking the correct classes that you're not taking unnecessary classes that you're not wasting your time that you're just chilling at the school getting extra credits for no reason make sure every class you're taking is building up toward your degree because a lot of people sit in college and make a lot of mistakes and they don't even know that they're taking an art class and they need they don't need a, um, a credit in that area you know what I mean like, don't waste your time y'all I'm not bragging or none of that but I literally went to a community college and it was a two-year college and I graduated in a year and a half under two years like one I went to summer school they offered two free summer classes I was like <laughs> I'll go to summer school like that's nothing to me like two classes in the summer that's late like anything to get me out of here one thing about it if you going to college be about your business like it's one or the other it's either you're going to be about your business or you're going to be there to have fun it's two different people I'm talking to the people that's there to be about their business okay stay on top of financial aid stay on top of financial aid because they will try to sneak you they will not try to give you your money and if you think your mom makes too much money or you think you're not eligible still apply you never know what could happen like they be giving people money and it's really a hit or miss with them whatever they ask you for give it to them give it to them as soon as possible so it doesn't delay you stay up to date with financial aid because like i said it's literally a hit or miss with them and you never know you might get you some money the last thing i'm gonna leave y'all with is what works for me is what carried me through school not just college like school in general my favorite form of studying is to write things down rewrite them i know like nowadays it's really like technology based like school is really technology based and it's like cool and everything but writing stuff down helps me remember so that's just my advice to you guys if you feel like you're still not getting the work no matter how hard you try or you're not understanding just try rewriting the stuff down like if it's in an article or if it's on the computer still just write it down just 
take out time with it when you write things you remember things you know what i'm saying so that's the last thing i'm gonna leave y'all with i hope you guys are having an amazing semester i know how fun college was and i did have fun so i hope you guys are having the same and feel free to hit me up if you need me if you want to ask me any more questions i'm here i'm open don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video